Good day, my name is Doug. I'm playing Seven Days to Die Alpha 19, the stable version. And we are doing a trader quest. We just created a drop chest. Make sure. Yep. Always helps to mark them so you don't forget about them. That's always embarrassing. Okay. Let's be honest, I've left a lot of things here. Some things that I'm just not ready to do away with quite yet. Did I leave? I did. I left the shovel back there. Bugger. Rabbit. Oh well. Chasing rabbit, it just seems to be a waste of time. That's the club. I just get rid of the club. I'm never gonna use it. There's the shovel. Okay. I have to. This is a fetch quest. <laughs> hmm. And I gotta tell you, with fetch quests, the thing to do really is to find the uh, courier bag quick. So that if you do die, you don't end up losing the quest. Courier bag is what it's all about. Now, the way I do that is not going to make some people happy. Because <laughs> it's going to seem like cheating. But the checkpoint, as I said, isn't to do the quest the way fun pimps want you to do it. The checkpoint is to get the uh, there we go, to get the uh, courier satchel. Okay. Now we come back here and we do the magic. Look, the concrete's back. Or the cement. And remember, we have a working cement mixer at the trader. So I can turn the cement into concrete. So it's going to be in the basement, probably in the end of POI. Which... Okay, I'm just going to leave the rest of this stuff here. Okay, so... Well, I could go through and basically just search out the uh, satchel at this point. It looks like I have to go through this pretty much from the beginning. Anyway, 
So that's the way we'll do it. Anything that I need to take? Nope. As I recall, there was nothing in here. Nope. Okay. after it's done. safe. Damn it. Oh well. The advantage to a sledgehammer is it is a silent weapon. Okay. I'm guessing the cat. Yep, there it is. Damn it. Trying to find the. There we go. Okay. And that is the official end of this. Well, I mean, I have to run it back, and that's what we'll do next, but so far as the, uh, the risk of failing this because I die, that's over. Working stiff. I'm really hoping for iron tools, preferably an axe or a big axe. But, you know, we'll take those. Here's some more axe or pickaxe. We want iron. Let's 
stone shovel. Yay. stuff and then come back and clear it out. Really? What is a dancer doing way out here? Cricket indicates that it's six o'clock. as quick as possible because I do not want to get caught out after dark. to see any tiles or any uh, secret areas. Hey, I missed that entirely. Shaka Messiah. Okay. I wonder if that was there the last time. before I can use it, but I wonder. 
There's no way. <laughs> There's no way. Yeah. Nope. Okay. <laughs> that would have been too, too bizarre. I dropped dead point. Let's go hit the kitchen. Coffee, good. Okay, time to go. Food is a critical item. I don't even have time to stop at the trader tonight. Because it is on the other side of town from my perch. Trader Joel's is now closed. And yeah, there's that too.
box. Actually, being pretty careful to make sure I leave some uh, some endurance in reserve um, when I go to ground, because if there is something close that sees me, I'll need to be able to run further. And I drank the coffee because it gives me a uh, boost in recovery. back here. That is the end of day two. That's the trader quest. We will go ahead, obviously, and recover the, uh, or get the, uh, uh reward tomorrow. Um, tonight I'm going to go ahead and extend this wall out a little bit. And obviously try and get something to eat. Now that I have, yay, my pot. If you like what I've done here, please leave a like. If you've got any comments, either pro or con, I am still trying to learn how to do this. Please leave them, and I will see you next time. Take care.